Greetings and salutations, folks. My name is Nick, and welcome back to Resident Evil Village, where last time and the last time before that, we might we found ourselves stuck within uh, Castle Dimitrisk, where we found ourselves up against uh, Lady Dimitrisk, as long as well as her three daughters. One of them is dead. Two more to go, plus the tall vampire herself. I don't remember if I have something specifically for these angel busts, but I do have... This is a bigger suitcase. So let us arrange a little bit better. We've got explosives on the bottom left, weapons in the top right. Uh, top left, should I say. Um, I know my cardinal directions. Um, ammo on the top right. Health items on the bottom right. It's not going to stay that way because... Oh yeah, I've got the uh, wine. That is what I have. So now I can go upstairs. To... Not through there, but even further upstairs. Also, how Ethan's hands are still attached to his body is itself a miracle. Like, he's had one of his hands bitten. Um, he's had both of them stabbed through hooks. Of which, he more or less just yanked the hook right through the whole thing. And what have we here? It's a key to the courtyard. So now we're going down through there. It looks like I left... <laughs> I, I admit, like, uh, even, even though I don't... I don't exactly know exactly how scary this game particularly is. Um, it is very easy to get apprehensive when it comes to opening doors. Shall I'll... I give it to her? Uh, no, thank you. <laughs> ah, excellent. It's a little bit late to worry about giving me a tour. Maybe if you offered earlier. Also, it seems as though she has not followed me, so let's take a step back into the dining room. See if there's something... I may have missed. Just... just a... Oh, there we go. There we go. Now we're done with the dining room. I also upgraded my pistol, I've upgraded my shotgun. Uh, specifically the power. Um, like, things like being able to reload faster are neat, but you still only get the same amount of ammunition. So we've got two exits, one on the left and one on the right. This does not go to one. Okay. This just loops back to there. Excellent. That looks kind of locked, if I had a guess. Yeah. 
It's locked. Who would have thought? Dimitrisk. Dimitrisk's key. Wow. Um, I hope you don't mind replacing all of this fine pottery uh, once I've been gone. That's a door that doesn't even care to be opened. It doesn't even give you the illusion. <gasps> now I'm hoping I don't have to deal with any... Crystal fragments. Because I feel as though this the hunt for crystal fragments... Are you something I can... Mmm. The hunt for hanging things and small sparkling lights does not make for a fast-paced experience. Nope, that is a non-breakable. So if you any, anybody sees any sparkling lights that I happen to not mention, just be sure to drop it in the comments. And I will somehow go back into the past and tell myself to collect it. Very easy. Barely an inconvenience. Hmm. Of course, I might just, uh, we're probably going to be passing through this area later on anyway. So I might give up the search for now. And then try again the next time I pass through this specific area. All right, we'll do that. Ah, this is a plot door. It's a good thing she doesn't notice the door just downstairs being open. Otherwise, I might be in trouble. Ah, does this compromise both the first and second floors? I hope so. Let's see if the answer is yes. It is no. I didn't see anything for me to... Any drawers to open? Any sparkly lights for me to shoot? Oh, I missed that drawer. Chem fluid. Um, by the way, Lady Dimitrisk, please ignore the sound of gunfire coming from downstairs where you just were. That's just Ethan Winters randomly shooting things in your in your house. Not not even your your daughters, just just the things in your house. What have you done to my daughter? Um. I may have killed her.
Ah, a map. Hall of Ablution? Um, hmm. Yeah, I realized that was empty before I slashed it, but, you know. Had to be sure. All right. This is a perfectly normal room to have in one's home. Where you have your statue of man riding horse, woman in robes, fancy lady, the poor. Women are blind to male advances. But the poor shall take their chances to give their lord their bounty sown, so that soon the wine may flow. Okay, that first clue, women are blind to male advances. So these guys are all like, oh yeah. But she does not care. Okay, good. She only has two settings, right or left. But she doesn't care. Um, but the poor shall take their chances to give their lord their bounty sown. So perhaps... I guess I'm assuming... So who does she represent? Uh, but the poor shall take their chances to give their lord their bounty sown, so that soon the wine may flow. Hey, there we go. Oh, no. Nope. By the way, did how does the Oh, there there's a goat. Take that, goat. I'm pretty sure I missed a few goats. What the hell? Oh, great. We're probably going to have to deal with, um... Underground ladies again. Where am I trying to go to? Is this all wine, or blood, or water, or some sort of mixture of the two? Great. Everything is going A-OK, -okay. nothing spooky at all.
Also, I just realized I can hold more bullets. Does it actually tell me the maximum capacity? Don't know. Or was I just, did I just run out of room? Oh. Anybody behind me? Um, where did that come from? So far, so good. Oh my... Alright. I'm guessing I'm gonna have to make use of that cupboard in due time. But first, let us enter the distillery. Actually, I passed by a door. Oh, never mind. I did not pass by the door. The door is upstairs. It just looks like I passed by a door. Um. Excellent. Are you done? Yes, you are done. So basically, the floor has become a monster closet. It's these boots again. I've heard about these boots. How reusable these boots have been uh, for this game. Like, there's some pretty good bo boots. I mean, they probably will keep your feet pretty comfortable uh, while walking around this... Uh, Whoops. All right, herb, herb. Um, what am I looking at? We've got one first aid. Do I need chem fluid for that? No, I don't. There we go. I see that this game feels like it's giving me more options towards crafting than just uh, ammo. Though I suppose it makes more sense for you to find ingredients to make stuff inside of a vampire lady's castle than it does to find shotgun shells within their pottery. Hello. Anybody behind me? Nope, just... Just you. Alright, distillery is emptied. Uh, 
Ah, this is how we get outside of Lady Dimitrisk's window. For that scene where I see her throw a... ...fancy vanity. Oh. Was this door locked? It was just blocked off by a curtain. Either way, it has a save game. Let us save our game! It's that boot. Mother Miranda, I regret to inform you that Ethan Winters has escaped that fool Heisenberg. Because he is in my castle and has already proven too much for my daughters to handle. When I find him... No, Mother Miranda. Yes, of course, I understand the importance of the ceremony. I won't let you down. the ceremony that man will pay for what he's done but what about the ceremony you, you wouldn't want to ruin that I imagine whatever that in entails sorry about your powdery We were all called by Mother Miranda to decide the fate of the child's father. Just thinking of that family make meeting makes me shudder to think I'm treated like a sister to those miscreants. Especially Heisenberg. That riffraff wouldn't know proper manners if they slapped him in the face. I would have sliced him to ribbons if Mother hadn't stopped me. Why? Why does she treat me the same as them? She gave me this castle, obedient daughters, everlasting life, did she not? Am I not her favorite? Am I not special? I need a drink. Hmm. How does one find meaning in their life? Even as a tall, super tall vampire lady. Where are you? Even super tall vampire ladies have feelings too. Oh, hello. I all this for a child who isn't even here. What the hell do uh, you ungrateful, selfish wretch? You come into my house. You lay your filthy man hands on my daughters, and now you even try to steal my property. How dare you? Well, your daughter's... You can, because I will hunt you, and I will break you! One, I did intend to search the room next to your... Ahead, to yours. Your and two... You didn't have to hunt me if you didn't throw me through the floor. Just saying. Just, just throwing it out there. Should I just load my game so I could, uh... Hmm. I'll do that. Okay. So, previously, I did not try this door. It is locked. Well. That definitely puts, uh... 
makes things qu quite simple. I thought I had missed out on some means of exploration. Do your worst. But alas, I had missed nothing. I guess I'll still have to go back up there uh, to fully explore the area. Also, I suppose it's inevitable that uh, he makes an enemy out of her. But it's always probably a good idea to maintain your status as an enemy or a known enemy. Um, keep things quiet as long as you can. Though I suppose he could only do that so much now that... Especially since she knows that one of her daughters has been killed. Okay, is this a fight bad guy scene or a run scene? I have a feeling it is a run scene. I'm just waiting for the bugs to start appearing. All right, we got some chem flu. Okay, so now we've uh, searched this entire area. My hand. Ah, let you get away. You'll be sliced to ribbons before you ever see me, child. Ah, son of a. Okay. You will learn what it means to insult our dummy Trask. Ow. Okay, I've lost track of where things are. My right hand is unusable. Great. Uh, door. Through the door. I guess just dead. Let's try that again. Uh, unfortunately, this means I have to pick everything up again that I found. Which I think is just those two items. And then, let's get rid of our hand. That is a clean cut. She he asked her, her to do her worst. You'll be sliced to ribbons. Before you ever see child. All right. Let's you actually look behind us. Ah, it's that boot again. No, nope. son of a. She's over there. That means things are a okay, I guess. Right hand still unusable. A mask of sorrow. Oh. That probably goes into one of those statues. <laughs> Running will get you nowhere. Yeah, it'll get me farther away from you. There's that. Uh, 
I'm... It, it is something of magic that that works. <laughs> Yes. Well, let's uh, head to the front door. Why, hello! How are you? All right. So I've got the Angel of Sorrow mask. The Mask of Sorrow. It looks incredibly grieved. Which one was the Angel of Sorrow? Um, probably this one. It's a pleasure to see you safe. How were things? How are you? How are you still alive? So sorry are you one of them? Well, you'll find your way to her once you're out of this castle. Do you How have much... need of anything for the road ahead? How much do you know of what's Thanks going on? Thanks to your consistent patronage, I've expanded my services. All right. Um... All right, let's uh, see what I can sell. Of ways to pass the time. I can sell a crystal fragment, a crystal skull, so not too much. Bits and bobs. I see. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Um, I've some new stock. Well, let's see what he's got. You've got some first aid med. Some sniper rifle bullet uh, recipe for a sniper rifle that I do not have. Handgun ammo, which is relative. Is that per bullet? Is that 150 per bullet? Hmm. I'm tempted to get the high capacity mag. You'll be slaughtering things in droves. Thank you for your patronage. Oh, you're welcome. All right. Now that we have survived the attack from Lady Dimitrisk, let us return. Uh, to the courtyard. Where we can actually use her key to leave the, uh... Let's, let's say that's the north side. Yeah, the north side of the courtyard. Oh, hello. Wait long. Uh, no, you, you didn't keep me, uh... It wasn't a bother at all. Oh, hello. Don't mind up. Don't mind me. Just passing on through. Take that. All right. Shall I go into the opera hall? 
or is this door locked? It's locked from the other side. I have a feeling I'm not alone. Or I might be. Uh, that sounds like some bugs. Uh, please be aware the mistress's lipstick is missing. If anyone finds it, could they please return it to her bathroom? It is custom made and therefore very expensive. Okay, opera hall or library? Opera hall. One day since treatment, the three girls have stopped moving. They seem almost dead. An insect flew out of the eldest's mouth. It seem, appears to be a common fly. Two days since treatment, all three bodies are covered in flies. It appears the flies are consuming their flesh. When I opened the windows, some of the flies dropped dead to the floor. It would seem the cold petrifies them. I quickly close the window to avoid weakening the insects further. Four days since treatment, all three bodies have almost been completely consumed by the insects. All that is left is a dark, writhing, human-shaped mass of creatures. It is just afternoon, and the insects have started to change color. Those around the face turned pale, and those around the lips turned a deep crimson. Six days since treatment, the mass of insects have transformed into human bodies again. All three girls awoke, looking at me like newborns. I sense a bond between us, like mother and daughters. I have already decided their names. Bella... Daniela and Cassandra. Hmm. Okay. Well, I suppose now the hunt is on. Flowers, swords, ball. A ball made of metal de decorated with flower and swords. Is this for the labyrinth? Oh, I see you there. And you there, too. An easy to pick lock. Mmm. So many easy to pick locks, so few lock picks. Mmm. <sighs> Um, impressive how uh, Ethan's able to play without all of the fingers on one of his hands. 
Iron Insignia Key. Scientific name, none. That's an interesting name. Similar body structure to blowflies, although there are differences in the head. They are carnivorous and vigorously consume meat. In order to catch unsuspecting prey, they'll gather using pheromones to mimic a human. They are produced when a caddo lays eggs in its host, but the flies themselves are unable to reproduce. They are weak to sudden drops in temperature, especially if the temperature drops below 10 degrees Celsius, 50 degrees Fahrenheit. Their metabolism lowers and they go into a dormant cryptobiotic state, similar to the cryptobiosis of tardigrade or polypedilum van der Plancae. Exi yep, yep, exactly, just like those. I pronounced those words perfectly. Um, no one can say differently. Who is around me right now. I didn't check anything else upstairs, so let's quickly run up. Wait long. Let's not run up. Hello. Don't mind me. Just passing through. Um, let's go to the merchant's room. Sorry. Still don't mind me. Ah, hello. Sorry. Don't mind me. Heading over here. How are you doing? You, you and I, let's let's be the best of friends. Um, all right. Okay, I was not expecting this to be an actual game of Labyrinth. Um, what did I do wrong? It's kind of hard to tell. Because the camera is... Not particularly good. Oh, wait. Hold on. I wish there was a way that I could... Tilt the camera so that I could kind of see those hollows. No. There we go. Oh. That was literally just for money. That was... I was just thinking of ways to pass the time. Lots of money. Ah! This is all an investment, Ethan. All right, all right. I'll take your word on that one. I look forward to seeing the fruits of your exploration. All right, where do I need to go? I mean, I could try for the library again. Hopefully this time I don't get blocked off by Lady Dimitrisk. Did 
Don't mind me. So we finally Just passing through. I think that might have been wasted. I'm sick of bugs. I'm also sick of bugs. All right. Whew. Two daughters down. One to go. The decline and fall of the Demon King? All right. That's uh I wish the titles weren't so blurry. All right. Is there anything else for me to pick up in this room that I probably would have been able to use in said boss fight? I th it seems like it, but at the same time, the room is telling me I'm not done. Hmm. I don't see any glowing tidbits. Um, hmm. I think I'm going to call it for now and then come back later. Oh, nope. Here we go. There we go. All right. Hall of Joy. Are we going to get another angel mask in here? Yes, we are. Atelier. I don't 
know why she's so joyous being stabbed. Let the five bells of the chamber ring out. All right, that's two out of five. Three out of five. Oh, hold on. Is that a bell inside there? Four out of five. Oh. Five out of five. Missed something. There we go. That probably was it. Okay. I think this is where I'm going to be stopping for the night. Got any suggestions for something to play next? Leave them down in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have yourselves a good night.